Our life may actually flash before our eyes during death. Human brain activity in the final moments before death has been observed for the first time, revealing rhythmic activity comparable to those seen during dreaming. The observation could support reports from near-death experiences of life flashing before your eyes in what's known as life recall. In a new study, US researchers say that as we die, our brain waves show up in the same way that they do during dreaming, recalling memories or meditating, and our brains remain active and coordinated during and even after we pass. The team was measuring the brain waves of an 87-year-old man with epilepsy when he unfortunately had a heart attack and died. They were able to gather data in the 30 seconds prior to and after the patient's heart stopped beating. The researchers say the brain waves they recorded are usually involved in high cognitive functions and could be a literal example of someone's life flashing before their eyes. The team measured 900 seconds of brain activity around the time of death and set a specific focus to investigate what happened in the 30 seconds before and after the heart stopped beating, said Dr. Ajmal Zamar, a neurosurgeon at the University of Louisville, US, who organized the study. Just before and after the heart stopped working, the team saw changes in a specific band of neural oscillations, so-called gamma oscillations. Brain oscillations, more commonly known as brain waves, are patterns of rhythmic brain activity normally present in living human brains. The different types of oscillations, including gamma, are involved in high cognitive functions, such as concentrating, dreaming, meditation, memory retrieval, information processing, and conscious perception just like those associated with memory flashbacks. Through generating oscillations involved in memory retrieval, the brain may be playing a last recall of important life events just before we die, similar to the ones reported in near-death experiences," Zamar speculated. These findings challenge our understanding of when exactly life ends and generate important subsequent questions, such as those related to the timing of organ donation. Something we may learn from this research is that although our loved ones have their eyes closed and are ready to leave us to rest, their brains may be replaying some of the nicest moments they experienced in their lives. Thank you for watching. Eliza Botticelli for the Neutronium Alchemist. And please, don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah.